Messi is back, Inter Miami is back. Yes, guys, welcome back to the channel. Let's react to Inter Miami 3, Nashville 1. That was the second leg of the Champion Cup from CONCACAF. First leg, as we know, finished 2 wall, and Inter Miami is through to the quarterfinals. But my question is, and I want you guys to leave a comment, what would it happen to this Inter Miami without Messi? We've seen plenty of times without a Messi. It's just like these guys haven't got motivation. But by the way, I'm going to share my screen now. We're going to watch the highlights and um, we're just going to react to the goals, to what happened to the game. And I'm not going to lie. I've been so busy, so I did not have time to watch it. As much as I love Messi, of course, he's never the Bay that is ever is the greatest of all time. But look, I've been busy lately, so I did not have time to watch. Not even the highlights. I haven't absolutely see anything. So let's do the reaction, and I'm probably gonna stop through this video just to give my thoughts and stuff but yeah if you're new to the channel please make sure you subscribe and keep smashing the like and i really appreciate all the love and support and yeah mason suarez again i mean what can you say the greatest do of all time the got do here we go look at him he's like you know this guy's when messi's playing it seems like these guys are completely different footballers. When Messi's not playing, it's just like they don't care. It's just there's not motivation in there. Suarez, best striker of this generation and one of the best strikers of all time. For me, the greatest, I've said this plenty of time, the greatest striker since R9 Brazilian Ronaldo. So, yeah, that was the second leg of the um, CONCACAF Champion Cup between Inter Miami and um, Nashville. The first leg was tough, you know, Inter Miami was losing to nil, but when you got Messi and Suarez on a pitch, you know, just having Messi, everything is possible. They managed to get a draw. Um, it was a good draw going into the second leg, but yeah, Messi, let's not forget that Messi, ooh, is that free kick? Yes, free kick in hell. Yeah, let's not forget that Messi did not play the last game due to a knock. Like, it looked like he got injured on the game before and then enter Miami, as usually with our Messi, they look absolutely trash. Free kicking here for Messi. Ooh, that was a good block from the wall. I wasn't Messi in here. Ooh, the gods is cooking. Sorry, guys. Let me just quickly... Come on, just take this video away. Hold on, guys. Hold on. I'll be back. I'll be back. Keep smashing the like and drop your fuzz as well. I was messy through kick. I can't put it back a little bit. Right. Let's let's look a better to this through kick in here. No, no. Sorry. That was not the through kick. That was... Oh, that was a good chance for Messi. Good chance. My God. Messi. Suarez. 1-0. It had to be. It had to be the gods. And it had to be Suarez. What a ball. What a finish between the keeper's leg. Typical from Suarez. What a finish. Look at this ball. The most complete football of all time. Lionel Andres Messi. What a ball. Messi's back. The part in Miami is back, baby. 1-0, I think they will win at least another trophy this season. Ooh. This Inter-Miami defense worries me quite a lot. Ooh, free kick. Redondo, the Argentinian. What's going on in here? Come on. Let's go. Suarez. The handball? That was Suarez handball. <laughs> oh, Suarez being cheeky now. 
Suarez being cheeky now. Ooh, well, that was a good chance. Too poor, too much space. Too poor, this defence, like, I swear to God, man. What would it happen to this, this Inter Miami without Messi? Before Messi joined them, they couldn't even win. They couldn't even win a game. And then Messi, I, I swear to God, I've said this as well plenty of times. One of Messi's biggest achievements. Ooh, 2 0 Messi. What a finish from the greatest of all time. Suarez between two players. Great ball from Suarez. And that finish from, typical finish from Messi. Wow. Wow, wow. The greatest. Just too good. Too good. I mean, this guy, he should be a rest, mate. Shouldn't be able to play football. It's just too good. But very good work from Suarez. They know each other like, what kind of language this guy's talk to each other? I don't even know. This guy's like, this dude is just something special. Ooh, that was again. That was Jory Arba, by the way. Was it? Looks like Jory Arba. He actually, he, he did play this game. I haven't even checked the lineup. Inter Miami win 2-0 up early again. That's good. By the last game, they lost 3-2 with our Messi. Of course, you expect. And Suarez. Suarez only come on, I think, for the last 10 minutes. But like I said, I think this Inter Miami will win at least another trophy this season. They have never won it before Messi joined them. Then they won the League Cup. And um, again in here, um, I think is the biggest achievement in Messi's career. Winning a trophy with this Inter Miami team. I mean, come on. I know they got Suarez now and stuff, but still, they aren't good. Let's be real. They're good when Messi plays, of course, but without Messi, well, it reminds me of another club. My club. I don't want to even speak about my Barcelona. Ooh, good try. Did he keep a save that? Did he keep Ashley save that? Yes, I think he keep a save that. Good strike from Gomez. <coughs> Tata Martinez. Guys, leave your comment. What do you think about Tata Martinez? For me, he's very poor. Very poor. We saw with uh, Argentina, we saw with um, Barcelona. What a strike. What a goal that would have be. I swear that I hit the post and the bar at the same time. What a strike. That would have put, you know, game on with 2-1. Ooh. Not a good chance. Whoa. Good first half. Ain't you, um, Miami went 2-0 up early after 23 minutes, of course, with the greatest of all time with it net. A magic assist and a golasso. And um of course Mason Suarez is too good. Yeah, um I know I saw that. I mean I was reading today Macy only played um 50 minutes. He was replaced by Robert Taylor and um it's because of his knock in the last game they played not I mean the game before because he didn't play their last game the game before. And uh, with a nasty tackle. Into the Miami in here again. Crossing the box. Ooh, what a finish. That was Taylor. What a cross from Suarez. What a ball. What a header. Poor defense in here, let's be real. He's in there on his own, but what a header. What a pass from Suarez. What a pass. Guys, there has never been a player. I know this is not a Messi goal, but I was mentioning about Messi goal that there has never been a player that has assist Messi more than Luis Suarez. And these two guys, since they've been playing together, they have a combine of like over 400 goals. It's crazy. Just between they, uh, each other. Oh, that was a good chance for him, Suarez. Was that Jory Arba? Cross? Yes, Jory Arba. What a ball. Jory Arba was playing well. Last game, they lost 3-2. Jory Arba was their best player. He scored a bang as well. That 3-0, pretty much, that was that third goal, that's it, was finished. And they score now, because the first leg was 2 all. 
was Messi injured when that Messi got a nasty tackle when the player got the ball late and got Messi leg? Was he against Nashville in the first leg? I can't remember now. Sorry, it's too much football. But yeah, um, yeah, that was goal. That was not offside. Mate, that was close. I think that was Busquets who was putting him on side. No, it was offside. Was it offside or was it not offside? Yeah, it was offside. But they still scored. Now he's not offside. They got a goal back. Too late. It was just too late for them. That's it. That was the reaction from, you know, Messi's back. Inter Miami's back. The part in Miami's back. And Messi and Suarez, mate, what can I say about these two guys? I just want to know what kind of language these guys speak because their connection is just unbelievable. Absolutely unreal. But yeah, Inter Miami is through to the quarterfinal. Can they win it? Yeah, they can because they got the greatest football of all time. They still got Suarez. And at Suarez carrying that knee injury still. I mean, these guys are not young anymore, but I think they're still more than good enough to definitely take into Miami to a few trophies and stuff before they hang their boots and say, you know, I've won everything is enough for me. But yeah, guys, that was another reaction. I hope you guys enjoy. Please make sure you smash the like, new to the channel. Please make sure you subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next video. As always, thank you and God bless you all.